Hey y'all, welcome to a new vlog. I'm actually headed out to get my brows done. It has been a minute. They don't look too bad because I did try to pluck them. I think it was like last week or something like that. But yeah, I need my girl to thread these really good. I'm actually headed out of town this weekend to Houston, um, going with my friends. So I'm gonna bring you guys along, of course. I feel like today is going to be a very long day, y'all. I have been so exhausted. Y'all know I have fibroids, so I do feel like when I would say like seven days, eight days before my um, cycle starts, I start feeling like this extreme heaviness. Um, I actually am scheduling my surgery, I think next week. So yeah, I should be getting that done uh, within the next couple of months. So nervous about it, but also it's just, it's time and yeah, I don't want it to get worse. I have been, I have changed my diet though, so that I'm not feeding the roids, which is not the most fun thing because I love junk food, but it has helped me lose some weight. So I think I've lost maybe like 15 pounds um, and I can start to see it in my clothes even though my stomach is extremely bloated all the time. So anyway, Jackie Ina and Forever Mood came out with fragrances. I got one of the travels. This one had an early release date on Sephora. This is I Am Her. I've been testing it out for the last couple of days and I definitely have thoughts. Um, I ordered all four, which I ordered this one early access and then the next day the others dropped. So I ordered them but apparently my package is delayed. I definitely wanted to have this up before the sale. So maybe I'll just do a Sephora recommendations and just include my thoughts on this one instead of doing a dedicated video for Forever Mood. But yeah, I definitely have thoughts and they did not fill this up, okay? But I've been wearing it for the last couple of days. So yeah, I will update you guys hopefully. Um, so I need to film that today. I actually need to film an H&M haul Maybe a Zara haul. Y'all, I've been sitting on these pieces for my arm. I've been sitting on these pieces for the last like month. So yeah, you guys said y'all still want the content even though some things can be sold out. You know how H&M and Zara does. They always restock. So I link the stuff so that that way you can save them if they're out of stock and then get notified when they come back. So yeah, I need to do that today. I also need to pack. I also need to edit okay i'm gonna end up taking my laptop with me because i need to edit a vlog hopefully for sunday um so yeah i'm only gone for the weekend but i feel like i gotta get everything out especially you know gearing up for surgery so yeah i'm about to go get my brows done and i will talk to y'all later hey y'all so this is the before my wig is looking crazy and this is the after so you can see she cleans them up really nice but she still leaves them a little bit thicker like i like them um and then i also get my upper lip waxed <laughs> but yeah i'm about to head home so that i can get started on all the things that i need to get done um and hopefully i'm not up until three o'clock in the morning <laughs> i'll talk to y'all later hey y'all so i'm in houston with the friends there they go over there having adult conversation at the coffee table <laughs> she flipping through a book <laughs> so yeah we're here we're here for the weekend just for a little friend trip nobody's birthday just to enjoy and have a good time and it is so hot in houston but we're excited so um rich and i's room are not ready yet but Kanika's is, so we're chilling in here, and then we're probably gonna do something a little bit later. So I just wanted to update y'all real quick. And yeah, this room is so cute, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all when I get mine, but I love her room. Look at the views. So cute. Walk the truck on the other side. It's the next block. It's the next block. This little store on this right side, like on the same building, but they had one. It's directly across the street. Just go down that escalator. It's, it's not gonna look like nothing. It's gonna look like a bank or it, it look like a business. So if you go down the So it's illegal every, restaurants. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's illegal. No, I'm joking. Oh, we it's, joking. It's worth a mile. Okay. It won't be like three miles under the ground. Oh wow. Everything is downtown. Everything is downtown. under the tunnels in downtown. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. about Well the tunnels, I've heard about it, but I don't know if I've been in them. Okay, y'all, we're going to look for food and beverage. And this lady done told us to go in a tunnel across the tracks. I don't know if it's safe. We need to be worried. Or what? If you don't see the vlog, huh? if you don't see the vlog, you know what happened. I'm looking for it. <laughs> Hello. Hello. 
Okay. Yeah, it's under this building down there. Okay. Yeah. Across the street? Yeah, yeah. There's one door on this side and there's one across the street on the other side. Oh, thank you. Okay. Well, honestly, I feel like he said the same thing because I still don't know where I'm going. Okay. <laughs> she, she could say it just go under this building. <laughs> across the tracks up yonder. Where's the tracks? I still don't like, see the tracks. That was scary. Sounded. Oh, yeah, Houston. Oh, I get the street is the tracks. Oh. They do ride horses down here, so maybe they're. Hamburg. <laughs> But we'll see y'all. I'm gonna this the track. You see it? Oh, it comes in the middle. In the... Yeah, like in the I'll let y'all know when we get there. If we get there. there. <laughs> y'all. <laughs> Wait. That was a bus. <laughs> okay. We got down there and they had pot belly pig and water burger. <laughs> So we're walking back. <laughs> Disappointed. How do you guys feel walking back into this? Away from me with this Apollo. <laughs> Is the restaurant here open? Yeah, yeah it's open. It's, it's open, open now. Yeah. Thank you. Damn. Just try. I don't know. I don't want to get it. He said, just uh, try. Yeah, all Thank it's you. It's usually open at this time, but it should be open. Okay. Close. Thank you. It's 1.37. Like Brandon, that's so weird. He gonna do is have some dessert. <laughs> Found a way. Found a way. <laughs> Ain't told us nothing. You never look at, you have to start looking for the dessert. You, uh, that's how you judge a restaurant. Yes, that's true. You learned it here. I said, Rich, they have dessert. Yep, I'm already getting the, <laughs> the chef special. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm helping him out. <laughs> it's like I already have everything picked up, yeah. picked out. What's all that? The key line. So we actually ended up coming back and eating. Um, well, I didn't eat anything, but the um, restaurant inside the hotel. I don't know what this is called. I forgot. Oak and oak. Oak and oak. <laughs> what? Oak and oak. Oh, Hulk and Oak. It's really cute in here. <laughs> no. Okay, y'all. Who wants to tell this story? I wasn't even there. Richard, do you want to tell it? So, we're here. I'm going to have so to brighten getting... it. Oh, okay. Do it for you. Where you get the light. Okay. So, we're. Oh, wait, where are you? So, we're getting the luggage. <laughs> which, by the way, if you go to Houston, the luggage rack, I mean, you can start. On Tuesday, by Friday, your luggage was. I came to the hotel, went back and got my luggage. <laughs> like, seriously. It was. So we see, uh, is it, how do I say it? I don't want to do it. You said Ms. Netta. Mrs. Netta and Charles. Kanita spotted them. And so. But I wasn't listening, I wasn't paying attention. I don't know what I was doing. I don't know where. Oh, you, she was getting her bag. Oh. And so I try to whisper. <laughs> Where's the camera? I'm looking for I try to whisper. There goes Mrs. Charles or. Miss Netta. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Netta and Charles. Not, oh shit. It's not gonna do that, but I'll have to. Do okay. Why did it do that? Because I, I did. Okay. <laughs> what? Oh, because it's saying that it's this. Okay, there we go. Oh, okay. So Charles and Miss Netta. And I tried to whisper to Rick. <laughs> The way she folded her arms up and tilted her head down. Where's Missy Elliott? <laughs> no, he said, that's Miss Charles and Miss, well, he, I heard. Miss Elliott over there, but I don't want to be, you know, like, act like it's a big thing. And I was like, where's Missy Elliott? I'm going to go over there and say hello. Like, I love everything that you do. Child, like an old cartoon, she was winding up to sprint to go see Miss. I don't run up to I want to scare the lady. But yeah, I'm about to go over there. Because he's talking about he wanted to be, you know, chill about it. You know, hello, miss. How are you? It was the funniest thing. She's somewhere in California. Right. Not paying us at home. Get y'all friend. He over here giving the key lime pie. Look at West Lil. He giving it a review. Talking about the drizzle. And the crust is buttery. <laughs> this is a Michelin star review. <laughs> uh, what do you mean? Get out. He's making a reel, y'all. On, <laughs> <Is she playing? laughs> 
on how everything's bigger in Texas. Oh, well, and the only thing he done seen big was butt. <laughs> Big booty. <laughs> Big booty. <laughs> Everywhere. They so Everywhere. <laughs> Large. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ain't nothing. Hey y'all, so I finally made it to my room. I love it, it's so cute. We're staying at the Laura, which is an autograph hotel uh, Marriott. So let me show you guys around. This is what it looks like when you come in. I have a tub here and a shower and this is the vanity area it has like this victorian type of vibe we have full length mirror hopefully this will be good for outfits i didn't bring nothing serious but you know just to show y'all <laughs> and then this is the room so we have a king bed of course and then i have my couch and a little desk with my TV. Mini bar. And just some storage here, I'm assuming. So yeah, this is the vibes. And I love that I have all these mirrors over here, which is, I know it's dark, but it opens up to the bathroom. How cute, love this. Okay y'all, so if you know me, you know I have to unpack as soon as I get in my room. It's, I can't function any other way. <laughs> but um, these are my handbags that I brought. I know, an excessive amount for the weekend, but I was up all night, okay? I didn't get any sleep, so I kinda just threw stuff in my luggage. And when that happens, you tend to overpack. So it is what it is. Vault label, um, LV, Chanel, Fendi, Chanel, and Amazon. This is my swimsuit and a cover up. And then I also just have my undergarments and um, sleepwear here. Of course, the travel bag. And then these are the clothes that I brought and the shoes. So I have my Loewe tank. I've been living in this. Somebody said they were tired of seeing it. I told them to go ahead and unfollow me this weekend because it might reappear, okay? But I got this too big. I did not know the material was like this. I wouldn't say that it's really worth it, but you know, it is what it is. I got it on sale. And then I, I don't know why this is showing up red, like with the red tint, but I brought my Ajay top this is like a crop top gonna wear this with some jeans probably to brunch and then i brought this like trench jacket from amazon the drop i forgot the girl's name but i follow her on instagram um i don't want to mispronounce it and then it has the sleeves there but it's hot in houston so i took the sleeves off but just in case i have them y'all i do not like these hangers but anyway this is my dvf windbreaker i brought this because i thought this would be cute for just like a daytime situation I have these cuff jeans, probably gonna do it with some silver heels and a bag. And then I brought this Target linen black vest. I have the actual like stone color linen and I loved it so much that I wanted to get the black. This is another look that I can wear like for dinner, but super casual. It's a Zara top that I got, I think last year in the sale. And then I have some express jeans here. And then this is probably what I'm gonna wear to dinner tonight. This is a lace set from Zara. And I have just like an oversized blazer. I don't know where this is from, but it does have cutouts here. Maybe pretty little thing. I didn't have like a really thin blazer except for this one. My other black blazers are either tweed or my Balenciaga Hourglass and it's hot here. So I didn't wanna do that. But um, because this is a full lace outfit, of course I wanted something over me. And then this is another like daytime fun fit. Um, I have these cargos from Zara and then this Zara tube top and like this rose gold. And then I also have this cute little daytime dress. This is from Anthropology. it's like a bubble hem. I got this last year, I think. And then I also have this H&M set, just in case like we do brunch or something. And then I brought a pair of shorts just in case. And then I brought my favorite jeans that I've been like living in lately. So yeah, an abundance of clothes, but it's like I really, you can tell I threw stuff in the bag. So I'm gonna try to make it do what it do <laughs> with these pieces. For the shoes, um, I brought several flats because 
I know Houston is one of those places where it's like turn up fun, have a good time walking around. So I brought these Dolce Vita um, slides. They're super comfortable, the black pair. Then I also have my Jimmy Choo's here. I love these. These are called the Pine. I've had these for a few years now. Then I have my yellow Hermes sandals. I actually brought those to go with a dress that I ended up taking out of my luggage. So a waste. And then I have my Adidas Sambas in the back. I have some Bottegas. Um, I have my Fendi heels and then some shoots clear wedges. And then over here I have my sunglasses, my jewelry, and my makeup. And yeah, that is pretty much it. Y'all, I also brought um, some silver heels. Why did I only bring one shoe? And I remember literally putting it in there and I didn't go in my other room to get the other shoe. Like, again, I was delirious. I had to do a lot of stuff yesterday. Um, and I woke up, I think around 7 a.m. and did not go to sleep at all until I got on the plane at 8.55 a.m. today. So. Your girl was tired, but I got some good rest on that plane, okay? I'm about to lay down for a hot second, then I'm gonna get up, get dressed, because we are going to like this happy hour and um, I think dinner later. So whatever we do, I'll try to bring you guys along. So talk to y'all later. Let's turn up in Houston. Y'all, I just woke up from a nap. Please tell me why. <laughs> I'm just not realizing the stuff I packed. What was the point of packing? I am bringing my black heels for my outfit tonight. Like I told y'all earlier, I brought one heel of another shoe. I'm all over the place. The lighting in here sucks. I'm having to use the backdrop as a mirror. Um, I like the room a lot, don't get me wrong. We're staying at the Laura Hotel, but the lighting is not good. They need a light like right here. Um, but. I also overslept because I hadn't slept in so long. Oh my goodness, I'm so tired. So I have to hurry up and do my makeup now. So I'm gonna have to rush this, but maybe this side is better. So yeah, I'm gonna have to rush this, but it is what it is. Listen, I'm here for the enjoyment. I don't care anymore. <laughs> I don't even care what I wear, but nothing that i brought is cohesive because i literally packed right before i came so that's what we working with let's see can i do this i literally can't see it's over Primer. I've been using the Smashbox primer. I really like this. OMG. I'm so tired, man. Anyway, let me try to get let me try to get dressed real quick so I can transform because I look like in the heat of the night. <laughs> and I'm trying to open up this beauty blend. I'm gonna have to use a, a old one that I already brought. Anyway, I'm gonna get dressed, try to at least. And I will talk to y'all in a minute. We're supposed to be going to a happy hour and also to dinner. So yeah. We'll see. Talk to y'all. Y'all, a disaster, okay? I ripped my pants. <laughs> I had some lace pants. I was trying to get the tag off, ripped, and I already didn't have any shoes to go with it, so. So I guess it wasn't meant to be for me to wear that. I'm wearing something super casual, but it is what it is. It's 80 something degrees, so it's hot. It'll be all right, and my wig looks crazy. I'm not having the best day, but I'm going to have the best night because I refuse to let this ruin my day. <laughs> I'm scared. This is where we're going. Kanitha has us going to somebody's house. Don't say it with me. Look, y'all. Me and Rich, we was like, ooh, this is interesting. He was like, oh, I'm never going here. <laughs> Kanitha said, this is where we're going. And then the Uber slows down. Exactly. Tragic. <laughs> There's a house door. Oh, wait. 
This is a screen door. Lord. All right, it's over with. back in the room it is kind of early 11 20 i mean i guess early for houston or you know a fun weekend but your girl is extremely tired okay and my back is hurting so it's time to lay it down but um houston is definitely like every place you go is there's a dj so it's like a turn up spot um but we ended up going to friends for dinner it was okay and then we went to a place called the living room for happy hour. Mm -mm, I wouldn't recommend that one. It's very, yeah, no. But tomorrow we're doing brunch. I forgot the name of the uh, spot. My friend Kanitha planned the whole thing, the whole weekend. So I'm just here going with the flow and having fun with my friends. But yeah, I just wanted to check in with y'all because my arm. But yeah, I just want to check in with y'all because, um, I can't really vlog at the spots because the music is going so I try to get like a little footage and b-roll but we'll see how it goes when it, you know it's time to edit because YouTube will flag you in a minute but yeah I'm exhausted I'm um clean up my bed go take me a shower and lay it down brunch is not until later in the afternoon tomorrow so we really have a nice day to like sleep in and we may go to the pool so we'll see um but yeah so i will talk to you guys tomorrow Bye. on second thought y'all i decided to run me a nice bath okay because this tub like i can't pass it up it's a beautiful soaking tub so so i'm gonna soak because my stomach is super bloated because i've been up my fibroids i feel like when i'm moving around a lot that's when my fibroids start to bother me the most and because i've been up like 24 hours um i'm definitely feeling it it's not it's not pain but it's just like a heaviness and extreme bloating so yeah um i'm gonna soak and relax and let me tell you the older i get the more i am like taking advantage of all the amenities at like hotels because it's when i was younger you could not pay me to take a bath in a hotel okay but i didn't clorox this thing down so i'm gonna enjoy it so yeah, I will talk to you guys in the morning um, if, and we'll see if we end up going to the pool or if I just sleep in and just end up going to brunch, you know? So anywho, bye y'all. Good morning y'all. So I had the best sleep last night. That bath really did help. So um, it's morning and I think me and Rich are about to go out to the mall or a couple of stores. Kanitha is tired today so she said she's just going to lounge around until um around three o'clock and then we're gonna go to this brunch so let me show you guys my outfit and also i'm not doing any lashes right now i'll probably put some on later but right now i don't feel like it so i'll show y'all my little simple outfit if it's not too dark because the light is behind me so we'll see okay it works better right here with the lights off so i'm just wearing this vest from target um i have the like linen sandstone color and I like the fit of it so I have it in black and then I'm wearing these jeans these are my favorite jeans of the moment I know y'all sick of hearing about them <laughs> and then I also have on just these really comfy Dolce Vita sandals they kind of look like Birkenstocks but they're leather and they just have like this rusted gold type of hardware okay back over here for the rings, this is my Perlitas this is my Rolex watch I'm wearing this uh, Vanessa Vark Vagarza necklace. I picked this up from Nordstrom. Um, I showed it to you guys in a vlog, but as soon as I 
bought it i guess i bought the last one because i can't find it anywhere on the website but i think it just adds like a little pop of color it's a red beaded charm necklace with a lot of different charms on there like a little diamond happy face it has a money sign hearts um the rock star sign clovers all the things and then on this side i'm wearing my perlitas as well on the rings and then of course my everyday bracelet stack and i found a way to travel with my favorite body oil um this is the caked up body oil from brown sugar babe and i bought this from target in the little travel section it really does hold this in no leakage at all this is better than their actual packaging because brown sugar babe like i have to keep it like on a tray because the oil just leaks out of it um every time you use it because it's so thin i understand but they need either a pump or like a different type of top okay but yeah this is good look how dark that is you know i smell good right now so it's like a cakey uh vanilla scent and then on top of that i'm wearing yara by latafa and i also have on a little cassiopeia i forgot about that so i have on a little cassiopeia from um tiziana terenzi and on top i have on yara this is just like a fresh um creamy floral scent in my opinion um it's it went viral like on tiktok and everywhere and i like this i think it's a nice topper i would never probably wear this by itself but i do think it's nice it does not smell like strawberry milkshake or anything though so yeah it's really cute and like i said a nice topper because cassiopeia though it is a tropical fresh scent it is still very strong so i just wanted to calm it down since it's pretty early today with the latafa by yara and then i didn't pack well like i told y'all so i'm gonna have to still carry my lv bag i'm gonna do it crossbody and hopefully it doesn't look so like extra i'll show y'all let's see i think it's fine it looks funky right it gives a little funky vibe so this is the look y'all and let me go find rich so we can head out i think i'm gonna do my celine sunglasses just keep it super simple and it's bright outside so i really need sunglasses and not like cute indoor outdoor glasses <laughs> okay y'all we up and out me and rich kanitha's still back at the room what taking a good nap she's taking a nap we're gonna head over to um we're actually gonna catch the train rich is guiding and <laughs> I think we're going to the Galleria and maybe TJ Maxx, Nordstrom, you know, all the things. So I'll bring y'all along. It's windy today, too, and I got on my summer outfit. It said it's 81 degrees, but it's giving 73. Playing and it'll be 120. You know, I packed for it. So I'm actually prepared this one time <laughs> because I brought the least clothes. So it's like. And now you need a shawl. Yeah, now I need to go buy some clothes. But we're leaving tomorrow anyway, so it really ain't that serious. I you can't know, believe it. tomorrow? Yeah, Sunday. Unless, oh, you leaving Monday, right? Look at Rich's Stop. stance. <laughs> Wait, He's about to fall much. off the bus. I'm literally flying out the beach. <laughs> this, right. It's a bumpy ride in Houston, child. We have to brace ourselves. No, this right here. <laughs> Whoa. She was more pissed because we made her miss the stoplight. Oh, yeah, for free. Yeah. Well, I didn't pay. I, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know how it worked. <laughs> she got bad. Hey, y'all. We're at the Starbeezies. Oh, and it's oh, yes. so blurry. I don't know why. Focus. There it is. 
So we got our drinks. I got a, uh, what's my order? I get a regular iced coffee, no classic, five pumps of sugar-free vanilla with the new lavender cold foam. So I'm excited to try it. And Rich, what'd you get? Uh, ice, peach iced tea. Peach, <laughs> peach green tea lemonade with extra strawberry puree at the bottom. I know that's so light ice. I know that's so good. Mm. Cause I love their uh, green tea lemonade. That's uh, so good. And then I got a ham and cheese croissant cause I'm hungry. And what'd you get, a custom, uh, cookie? Uh, cookie. So we're waiting on our friends. We're gonna walk around, see what we can find. If not, I mean, we're just out enjoying for now. So just wanted to keep y'all updated and I will talk to y'all if I end up getting some or if I go into a store that's and, sh and show you the reason why we're probably gonna be late for brunch. <laughs> what time is it? <laughs> it's one o'clock. That's we're why I put my makeup on. Because the only thing now I got to do is either change clothes. I can walk in this. I mean, I can go in this because yeah. if it's black and fun, yeah. I'm here for black and fun. <laughs> you know what? Is it good? It has the floral. Is that lavender? Yeah, lavender cold foam. It has the floral, but it still tastes like the sweet cream. It's different. I mean, I don't know if this would be like my drink, but it's not bad at all. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> Y'all, I love these. These are so cute and very comfortable too. I think they're real leather. $89? Yeah, they gotta be real leather. I'm gonna get these so cute. Hey y'all, so I'm in Gucci. I ended up buying something. I got some shoes. They finally had them in my size. Um, the Gucci sling bags. And I'm also getting the horse fit bag. Just the iconic original one. I think it's so cool. And the price point is not bad on it. They actually have a new bag out. I forget the name, but it's like long like that, but it's just rectangle. So I didn't like that one too much. It's more casual. This bag is good because it comes with a leather strap and also a chain strap. So yeah. Anyway, I'm about to hit. Say hello. <laughs> Are you on FaceTime with somebody? No. Yeah, we don't record inside the studio. Oh, I was recording myself. Okay, he said I can't record in here. Bye. and change into like a jacket like I said because it's chilly out here and they said it's really cold at the brunch spot so this is my bag um, I'll show you guys what I got later. sorry <laughs> y'all hey this is my fit DVF windbreaker jeans or Macy's shoots heels carrying my little Chanel bag and some shades. This set is from Amazon. It's linked to my Amazon Amazon store. Y'all, I just got stopped twice because I smell so good. I'm wearing Rosendo Matu number five, and I didn't want to get them on the blog because you know they waited until I like turn my camera off. But she took a screenshot of it because it was that good. And a lot of people say it has like this rubber smell to it. It don't to me. It smells intoxicating. Okay, so it's Rosendo Matu number five. I'm waiting on my Uber right now. Two minutes away. I said the Ubers here, they take a little while to get here. But um about to meet my friends for brunch. Apparently we had to get our order in by four o'clock. And I'm running late. So I just now got their text because my service is so bad. But, but yeah, y'all headed to brunch.
50-15. Why did it, we ended the night with just us? <laughs> How did that happen? Started with six, ended with two. With two? Like, I think the drinks weren't too strong. Even for me, and even for her. Cause she can handle. Look at my eyes, man. This lady was gone. It gave college days. Two like I couldn't find her. Through the club. I couldn't find her. Right, I dipped on these. You literally dipped. I dipped. I couldn't find her, y'all. <laughs> but we're in the Uber safe, and we're headed back to our hotel. That's all that matters, <laughs> y'all. We had to get a snack, which this is a whole meal, but Lotus Seafood, very good okay it's so good good morning y'all today is sunday it's our last day here in houston and we're about to go to brunch we're gonna drop off our bags at uh one of our friends houses and then we're gonna go to brunch we were gonna go to this place called taste um i forgot what happened with that but now we're gonna go to something in camp I can't remember, Kirby and Camp, Camp and Kirby? I can't remember, but I'll show y'all when we do. Um, last night, we had a time, okay? <laughs> I forgot where we went, but it was a time, okay? And then by the time we got, oops, my ring. Then by the time we got back, we were starving. Me and Kanitha came back um, by ourselves. Our friends, I don't know, they were doing something else, but I ended up getting loaded seafood last night. Ooh, it came in so clutch like Houston I don't even I think we got back in like one something the fact that I could get a whole seafood boil at one o'clock in the morning is literally the best thing ever okay Nashville could never you cannot eat anything after 10, 10 p.m. okay but yeah that food was so good I just got like a, I think it was a half cluster or one cluster um, a sausage link and corn it was just enough girl I tore it up and i got medium so good so yeah anyway today um like i said i'm about to get dressed i just packed up everything this is what we looking like and then that's what i'm wearing today i'm gonna wear this h m um two-piece set it's kind of like resort wear but i think it's perfect for brunch and i didn't bring a lot of stuff i brought things that were like summer but it's like it's 80 something degrees, but it's not hot. And I think it's because the sun is not like, like really bright. So um, I think it's supposed to storm today too. But either way, I didn't pack well. <laughs> so um, yeah, let me go ahead. So yeah, I'm about to do my makeup, put my clothes on and then meet my friends. And I will talk to y'all later. Hey y'all, finally dressed. Um, this is my fit. It's so dark you can't see me in the mirror. And then I'm wearing the Fumi Monet Exalté fragrance. And I think I might top it off with Escapade Gourmand because it's just my everyday. <laughs> but yeah, I gotta go head downstairs and meet my friends and I will talk to y'all when we get to brunch. Okay y'all, this is the fit H&M set. I'm gonna probably tie up the top because it's kind of big. Fendi bag and my bag. Oops, sorry. Oh, sorry. Get it in, my bad. No, sorry. <laughs> no, you're good. About six o'clock. Chapman and Kirby, honey, you did a sin for this Sunday. Yep. We've enjoyed you. And now we we're ready to go eat again because we the rooftop black experience. Yeah. It's a rooftop? It's like six people up there though. Oh, yeah. cause it's warm. So yeah, now we're gonna go to Papa Do's and really eat some. <laughs> You've been over there just to oh. cack. <laughs> you don't miss half of the show. I have missed it. Ooh. 
Yeah, no, oh, yeah, it was good thing it wasn't on because it wouldn't even work. Oh. It was all wet if it was on, yeah, because it the lens is out. Yeah, that's easy. <laughs> I already knew. I, I saw it happen in real time. Y'all, we made it to Papa though. <laughs> we had a little casualty. Just Jaden, I call him Justin. Lord, Jaden's new. We done spill water all over the table, but everything's fine. Yeah. <laughs> and we're gonna get us a little meal before our flight later on tonight. And y'all friend Richmond over there just to catch. I'm not a part of it. <laughs> Everything has sausage. <laughs> he wanted to know if we had to ask, does the cheesecake have sausage as well? <laughs> One more question. <laughs> Y'all, we just finished eating and we're both exhausted and sleepy. That meal took us off, but we're about to go and change and head to the airport so we can finally go home. Houston was a time though. Hey y'all, so I finally made it back home. I had such a good time in Houston with my friends and it's pretty late, okay? It's like 12 o'clock. So um, I'm gonna go get some rest because tomorrow I'm actually working with our luxury mall here, Green Hills. And yeah, I'm super excited to be doing that. So I'm gonna be doing like a reel and some stories for them. So yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in to the vlog and I will talk to you guys on my next one. Bye y'all. <music>